my name is Kelly Duncan, and I am the graduate assistant for the Tuba and Euphonium Studio at the University of Oregon. Today, I'm going to be taking you through the Euphonium audition packet for OMEA All-State 2024. This track is a chromatic scale with legato articulation at 72 beats per minute. It's very important that you practice this with a metronome and that you take a full value quarter note each and every note. Never, ever, ever let it clip. And each breath that you take, make sure it's nice and smooth and in time. My special tip for this chromatic scale is make sure that you plan out your breathing in advance to make sure that you have an easier time hitting all of the notes that you need to and keeping them in time. So for example, I know that I am more likely to miss a partial if I breathe while I'm playing up in the high range. So I plan out my breathing that I get a big breath right around the concert D and then I'm able to take the high range in one long exhale and then I don't need to breathe again until I'm coming back down on the E flat or the D. So that's my advice for making sure that every note can be nice and smooth through the entire thing. is characteristic study number one from Jean-Baptiste Arbon's Conservatory Method for Trumpet. For this etude, it's very, very important that you always practice with a metronome. Maybe start on the slower side and make sure that you can play every single note very well in time before speeding it up. Feel free to use three-finger technique here, so C's as one and three, so on and so forth, in order to assist in the facility of the lower range here. That's what I find myself doing. In terms of breathing, make sure that any breath disrupts the line as little as possible. So if you're not in a place with your quick breathing skills or you can't get in enough air during a very short clip breath, then feel free to take out a 16th note. Just make sure that you're doing it in a really methodical manner so it doesn't disrupt the line and it causes as little issue as possible. But it's most important that you're good and supported throughout the entirety of this piece. <laughs> The third track is a lyrical excerpt from Georges Philippe Telemann's Bassoon Sonata in F minor. This is a very expressive, dark, beautiful piece, and this is really your opportunity to let your musicianship shine. So feel free to use your vibrato, go as big as possible with the louds and as soft as possible with the softs, and really make a statement with this. My special recommendation for this is that you find the piano accompaniment on YouTube or on Spotify, and you really get that piano sound in your head so that you can pretend like you are accompanied as you're performing this. It's gonna help you fit better into the intonation that you need to be, and it's gonna help you be a lot more expressive. <laughs>
watching my video. I wish you good tone and good skills for your all state and regional auditions. And finally, go Ducks.